Hello and welcome to Shannon Gardens. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. So today I am so excited because I am talking about camellias. Um, camellias are evergreen shrubs that bloom typically in fall, winter, and or spring, um, depending on what kind of variety you get. So over the winter months when things are looking a little drab and dreary, it's so nice to have something blooming and looks so beautiful and it really stands out in your winter landscape. A camellia is something that I've wanted for quite some time and I'm so excited to finally get one and put it in our landscape. Um, the one that I chose is a Yuletide camellia and it blooms in the late fall and in the winter so I think that that's going to look lovely and it's got red blooms so that works out perfectly for the season and what I was looking for it to provide in my yard. Um, particularly on the opposite side of the yard, I have holly trees. So I think the red berries with the red camellia is going to look really, really nice. But there are lots of varieties of camellias out there. Um, they typically do well in zones 7 through 10, although there are some varieties that do well in zone 6 as well. There are a lot of different varieties that you can choose from, a lot of different colors and sizes, and they can get quite big. So um, there's so much to choose. And while I chose the Yuletide Camellia, I did, upon looking, when I first started looking for camellias, I visited a local nursery and I took some video of the different kinds that are available, which I'll show you guys just so you can get an idea of what's out there. Um, but for now, I will show Show you the one that I got and um, and then we'll get it in the ground all right all right so here is the camellia that I chose which is the Yuletide camellia and I'll show you guys because it already has some blooms on it which are so pretty there's one of the blooms and it should bloom from what it says. It's going to bloom in the winter. Um, it's an evergreen. There's lots of buds on here, which is what I looked for when I was looking for plants as well as new growth here at the top. So it looks pretty healthy to me and is uh, was $39 at Home Depot. And one other thing I wanted to mention is that camellias generally prefer part sun to shade. So they generally, not from what I've seen anyway, I haven't found any that prefer sun. So you're going to want to look for a shadier spot uh, when you are considering planting a camellia. All right, you guys, I just want to show you how many different varieties of camellias there are. Um, here we've got a silver wave camellia. And most camellias from what I've found are part sun to shade. This is a really big one, a uh, big plant. Look at all the buds here. So it's going to be beautiful. And then as we go around, there's Japanese camellias, which I believe that's what this is. This is the spellbound Japanese camellia, eight to 10 feet tall and six to eight wide blooms winter to spring. And that's the great thing about camellias is you're getting color when you really don't have color in your garden. Um, and there are definitely a lot of different colors to choose from. Look at the petals on this bloom. Oh my goodness. I cannot imagine how that looks in person because it looks lovely on the card. That is gorgeous. And let me see, actually, and this is the type of camellia that that is. Again, a late winter to mid spring bloomer, six to eight tall. And wow, said in up to 20 feet tall with age. Whew, that's very tall. Here's a, I believe it's a magnolia, magnolia flora camellia, partial sun, early blooms, a peach color. There's a debutante camellia, partial sun to shade, early blooms. There's the flower. And that is, let's see, zones eight to 10, six to eight tall and wide. And that's blooming now. Look at that pretty bloom. And it is a bonanza camellia. I think that is gorgeous. Here's another one in bloom now. It just says that it's an assorted camellia. Oh my gosh, so pretty. And just look at the line. 
so many different plants to choose from. All these are camellias down here. All these, some are in bloom now, some are going to bloom. Here's a beautiful white flower. Let's see what this is called. White Dove's Camellia. Oh my gosh, so pretty. Filtered sun, zone seven to 10, six to nine feet tall and wide. Here's another Camellia. This one made me laugh, you guys. The Hot Flash Camellia. There's the picture. That, that kind of made me giggle. Four to five feet tall, six to eight feet wide, shade to partial sun. Here's a Coral Delight Camellia, partial sun. Again, uh, this one is for zones eight to 10 and six to eight feet tall and wide, and it blooms early to late winter. So that is the color that you will get in early to late winter, which is would really stand out in your landscape during the winter months. The camellia is planted. You guys, I am so excited about this. I can't wait to see it as it starts to bloom even more in the fall or later in the fall and in the winter. So I think that these blooms are so pretty. Let's take a look here. Look at the yellow centers. I just think that's lovely. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. I am so excited to get that camellia in the ground and can't wait to see it in full bloom over the winter. Thank you so much again. Please make sure to like and subscribe and until next time, bye.